sugar baby. I'm Kelly Metzger. Some people know me as the voice of Nia on Ninjago. This is my vlog. And in this week's episode, I'm gonna take that rhubarb that I chopped up and I'm gonna turn it into some strawberry rhubarb jam. Care to join me? It's time for Making It With Metzger. Okay, I'm back. I'm gonna take my rhubarb that I harvested and chopped and froze, and I'm gonna make some strawberry rhubarb jam. So I'll put the recipe in the link below, but what I'm gonna use is seven cups of chopped rhubarb, seven cups of strawberries, four cups of sugar, quarter cup of fresh lemons, some vanilla, Salt, a little bit of pepper, and we're going to use no pectin and just lightly um, simmer it in this crusette pot for, I don't know, two hours and get it up to 200 degrees with this thermometer. And yeah, and let us begin. So I think we will look like this. Oh yeah, I definitely. Maybe like that big. Okay. Because then it can be um, chunky or or like that, you know? I'm just going to do it how I can do it. Okay. Chop away. Oh, I didn't even measure it. Close it. Wait. Oh, sorry. Right, one. Right, two. Oh, I don't even care. I don't care. Seeds in my hands. I'll give you one more, Leo. 
Now I'm going to get this up to 200 degrees and lightly simmer it until it seems really thick. And um, it's kind of a chunky one, but I think the pieces will get smaller as they cook. And um, I'm pretty sure it's going to taste good. Maybe I'll try. Actually tastes too sweet. I guess that's just sugar water. Tastes too sweet. I'm gonna add another lemon. Who needs an always pan when actually you can put any spoon on your on your handle? Don't need an always pan. Just need to push that. Okay, you've reached 200 degrees Fahrenheit. Thanks for joining me on this week's episode of Making It with Metzger. We ended up making about two and a half jars of this strawberry rhubarb jam. The reviews are, my daughter thinks it's a bit too sour. My son is gobbling it up in the form of peanut butter and jam sandwiches. We only have this much left, so we've already eaten a jar and a half by the time I've filmed this. So I think it was a success. I'll probably make some more next year. Next week's vlog is gonna be a little bit different. I wanna show you um, my setup for my film and TV auditions. Pretty basic. I'm a business owner. I'm an executive. If you enjoyed this week's episode, please like and subscribe. If you wanna learn how to do voiceovers for animation, check out my Skillshare link below where you can get a free trial month of Skillshare. And I'll list any products that I used in this episode below. See you next week, guys. See you next week, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye.